kinds of speeches and events are very dramatic. They're created that way on purpose, but that doesn't lessen the impact of an American president coming to a place like the Czech Republic, which has a uh, storied but not very long history with democracy. So it's dramatic. It's, a, it's an incredible setting. And it's true that, um, that, that the Obama operation, whether it was the campaign or the White House, knows very well how to put these things together. Um, speech making, of course, is something he is very good at. North Korea broke the rules once again by testing a rocket that could be used for long-range missiles. What they want most of all is not to test a rocket, not to you know, figure out what their technological capabilities are, but to gain international attention. In a strange turn of history, the threat of global nuclear war has gone down. And how better to gain international attention than to launch a long-range rocket on the day that President Obama is talking about nuclear proliferation. Especially developing countries. And Obama made the argument fairly in a fairly compelling way that this, this action, you know, thousands of miles away, actually underscores the importance of his message. But yes, it also does upstage, in a way, what he's trying to say. But I think the theme that we've seen throughout this entire trip is does popularity translate into policy and that remains to be seen that's an extremely open question he will get points most likely for tackling an enormous number of very complicated big issues but as he likes to say a lot the proof of the pudding is in the eating